We're back. We're back. This video is way overdue for you lot, actually. Way overdue. There's, there's no excuses. It's been far too long. As you probably know, if you've watched all my previous videos, that the transit went through some, some work. It went through some work, quite a lot of work. It's been through a lot of work ever since I bought it. Anyways, I did promise you that I was going to take you around and show you around the van and what had been done. So, today is that day. How lucky are you, lad? Some of you will recognise this location and it's actually called the secret location. Funny that, because it's not really that secret. Let's not delay this anymore. I'm going to show you the van, show you exactly what was done, show you what it looks like now. And then, I'm going to tell you what the future holds, alright? the future. Right then, so... This is quite familiar, this actually. I was in this exact location when I bought this van. There she is, in all her glory. I've even left me fancy lights on that Craig did for us. How cool do they look? Them little halos are lovely, aren't they? Right, I'm going to turn them off before uh, before the battery runs out and I can't start the bloody thing. Anyways, sorry for the road noise and the mic noise. Um, my mic actually has just run out of battery, which was rather inconvenient for this video. So we're just using the camera mic. Now, I've washed this van specifically for you lot today, specifically for you lot, and look, look what happened. Look at this. Someone must have drove past, haven't they, and splattered mud all up the van. Anyway, she looks good, doesn't she? She looks good. Now, if you remember rightly, because it was getting on to winter time, we decided that we were gonna that we were gonna underseal and protect the underneath of it. So all that was done. Now whilst it was in there though, we had the full kit off. We had the full body kit off. There were some marks along here, some rust marks which no longer exist. These corners here in there, rotten. These were rotten, so that's all being changed. We've had some brand new arches fitted underneath the kit. Now the kit has actually been stuck back on properly this time with some proper sticky stuff, so it's not going to come off. And uh, hopefully, look if you have a look around here, how tight it is. There's no there's no gaps whatsoever around there, so hopefully the water won't go down and sit in the arches. Same thing happened on this side though, look. It was rotten in this little corner here, the sliding door. That's all being repaired all the way up to here. All this bit was put in, all new metal. We had a lovely big dint in the front of the bonnet here. That is now gone. Um, oh, yeah, exhaust. The exhaust was modified slightly. So if you can see now, the exhaust sticks out a little bit. Beforehand, it wasn't like that. Because there was some uh, 
Can you see what I mean now? It like sticks out ever so slightly, which is what we wanted and what it should have been like. Because somebody has cut the exhaust basically off and then re-welded it together because they must have had a hole in it or something like that and they basically bodged it. So we've sorted that out and she's looking all right now. Now, I will... Oh yes, another thing down here. This whole back panel was terrible. Up here, if you remember, there was like all, it was all rough and looked like, uh, it was like bubbling, it was all bubbling down here. And it had loads of overspray and whatnot all over the side of this van. Uh, so this whole side here had been painted and it's like glass now. Look at that, look at that reflection. It's like glass. Basically, there's been a lot of work done to this van. And believe it or not, there's still, there's still stuff to do. There is still stuff to do. Right. Now, uh, so you, you all know what the van looks like. You see it on Instagram, if you follow us on Instagram every other day. It's basically now just got a lot less rust on it and hopefully it's gonna last a bit longer because we've protected it from the rust. Hopefully. Now, this van is pretty much, I'm not gonna say done because nothing is ever done. You guys will know this if you've got your own projects, it's never completed. There's not a great deal else that I want to do to it, to modify it, to change it. There might be the odd thing here and there, but more importantly now than anything is maintaining it, upkeeping it. And the most important bit, for me, the most important bit is using it. As you can tell in them videos there, it's by no means pristine. When you see pictures of this on Instagram and whatnot, it probably looks a lot better than it actually is in real life. It's an old Ford Transit. I've taken care of it, it's had a lot of money spent on it. It's still an old Ford Transit, remember that. It's not a show van, I use it every day. It goes down dirt tracks, it gets covered in mud, it gets used as it should, as I bought it for. That's my intentions of buying this. I wanted it because it was the perfect daily for me. So that brings us on to what's next. Well, summer is getting, it's creep, it's slowly, slowly creeping up on where the weather's getting a little bit better. So in the summer, we'll probably have the wheels off. Wheels are either, well, the chances are they are gonna get refurbished because they're shot to bits. Calipers will be getting repainted. There's a few little uh, tidy up paint jobs that need doing on the van. Um, so they'll be getting done. It does need, it does need a good polish because when it's in the sun, mm, yeah, when it's in the sun, it, it, doesn't, it doesn't look so good, that paint work. <laughs> it's full of, full of swirl marks and it always has been. <laughs> Since the day I bought it, it was full of swirl marks. It's still full of swirl marks. Apart from that one panel, the, the one side of the van that we got painted, that's pristine that. But the rest of the van, oh the bonnet, the bonnet's now great, the bonnet looks great. We've got two new vehicles coming to the channel. Not one, two. Should be interesting. Don't know how yous are gonna react, what yous are gonna think. At the end of the day, doesn't matter, cause it's my channel. But no, obviously, you know, I wanna make sure I'm, I'm keeping everybody interested and I'm, I'm making sure that you guys are enjoying watching the videos, more importantly. So you will be getting introduced to them at some point soon. I appreciate everybody sticking around and watching the videos. The channel has been doing really well, even though I haven't been posting as many videos as I would have liked to recently. If you're not subscribed by now, then I don't know what you've been doing or where you've been at. I feel like there might be a bit of a change up on the channel. I do, I really feel like there'll be a bit of a change up on the channel. For the good, for the good though, don't worry. Have a fantastic rest of your day, enjoy the rest of your week, and I will see you guys in the next video. Pew. Right, I think I'll go and take some pictures for Instagram, because I've got zero on my phone. None, nada. Where have I put the keys? There we go. Right. <laughs>